they can get the Gushan as early as now. Kasi kita na, nila, kita na nila yung Lolita and the Esmeralda. Picking up the Gushan here just demands them to play very aggressively. And that's safe given that their first pick was a Kaja. Yeah. Safe. Pwede sila manggulang. Cho, cho Gushan or Cho Kari? Uh, this can be the Kari already. Again, they're 50-50 on the carry. Yeah. I'm not sure how they're going to take that. Ooh, Your they've team stolen is the picking. Lunox. The double mage setup, remember. The yes. Esmeralda and the Lunox. Yes, we can see here in SXP. We can do it. Yeah. And if you don't forget that Lunox is SXP here, they can't pick up the Gushin later on. They can also run the double mage setup and get a fighter Cho. Now, Kufra will be the choice here for LPE alongside the Lolita. Ignored si Kufra for the past two games, right? Actually, yeah. Not Ignored. bad. Yeah. Not picked up. I like the Kufra here because this banning. confirms that uh, the Gushan will not show its face. Yeah, it's a heavy counter against the Gushan as well as the Cho. You, what you do with the uh, Kufra here is protect protect all times the Esmeralda. If anything, maybe the LPE is going to double mage. Oh yeah. We know, yeah, 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 we know that Rio is a beast on the Gushan as well. Yeah. So pwedeng very, sila yung magiging go ham mages. Yeah, problem with LPE right now is Pwede sila mamili ng ban. It's either, still, pwede rin kasing uh, ipilit pa rin na SXP yung Gushon or go for Akimi. Akimi uh, Digi? Yeah, Akimi Digi for uh, SXP. Remember, two picks sila dito. Ooh, that's Basia. A little, that's Your a little soft though. That's a little soft. Yeah. Personally, I say that's a risk. Pero yun nga, let's play the, the Baksha ban here. Oh, because Your of the Tham. Yeah, it's a heavy sustain lineup. Nakita na natin yan before. Okay. Yung kapag mag-isama yung Esmeralda and Thumbs as may Basia, mm -hmm. walang kwenta sa team fight yung dalawang yan. Yep, I like this. Uh, pero because of this Tham's pick, medyo ang pwede na lang ma-pick ma ma up is maybe the Gushon. Yeah. But not... I'm Again, still, ane, I'm still leaning on the uh, Digi Kimi. Yeah, there's a there's a voice in the back of my head that says Estes. Oh, Estes, last pick, no? Ewan ko lang ah, this wishful thinking. No, 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 no. There's already a Lolita. Eh. That's what I'm saying. Parang hindi na nga. Oh my God! Your team is picking. A blast from the past, ladies and gentlemen. One of the few counters against Lolita and Esmeralda. The gatot. No, tatalon ka hindi mas maganda akin. Di ba? Pag tinalon mo yung kakampi ko, tatalon ng ko yung kakampi mo. And the taunt, the taunt is so good. Yeah. The you, taunt is so good. Oh Given this God. kind of lineup, this is so, so Kadita. good on the side of the Punishers. But tell me about the Kadita here. I like this one. This is the punish for what SXP's team fight is, uh, is bringing against L L LPE. If you want to engage against LPE, there is a reset factor from the Kadita. And if you look at their heroes, the Cho is the only mobile one. Kahit pa sabi mo medyo may mobility then yung Kari at Lunox, they're no, ano, they're, single, they're statues in front of Kadita. It's a single out. Yeah, it's a single out. They're really statues, stone statues against the Kadita. Gargoyles, diba? kumbaga. Gargoyles. I indeed. love it. Okay, again, uh, if this does uh, turn out the way you think it will, mm -hmm. given the draft and the perfect execution, the ideals, Magiging parang game two ito. Yeah, on paper, this is looking to be a very good draft for LPE. Nakita niyo yung mukha ni Panda kanina at saka ni Exhort. Sabi niya, pre, appear. Last oh, pick ka dita tayo. Ito na yun. Ito, finish na to. Oh, <laughs> but then again, it's still gonna come down to the game. Ladies and gentlemen, with bated breath, we here at uh, the studios uh, bringing you the action. It's the ML Tandem Midnight and Leo. Yeah. Ito na yun. Last game for the day. This is bound to be a slobber knocker. Uh, is that our official prediction? Parang Midnight, is it going to be... I think so. I think so. Whatever happens, I'm happy with how the draft turned out to be. You know me, I'm a draft guy. Draft pa lang eh, parang naglaro na sila ng game eh. Okay, I'm also happy seeing this this heavy frontline lineup. But let's see, SXP vs LP, it's game 3 ladies and gentlemen. This is going to be quite the long one. Pakilala natin yung mga teams. On the blue side, you have SXP Lard on the Kaja May as the Cho hate. With the Lunox, Dian man ang gagamit ng Gatot Kaja and Etomax with the carry. Three games. Three games on that carry, and it seems like he knows it like the back of his hand. Yep. On the side of the Eagles, though, it's nasty on the Lolita Rio as the uh, Esmeralda Bimo naman ng ating Kufra. Kilowash ang Thumbs as si Exhort ang Kadita. I really want to see this Kadita work because it's been a while since we saw Kadita that uh, just, just works just yeah. like magic. It's one of the few mages that are uh, uh, very insulting First against slot. the uh, Lunox. Pero nakakuha ka ng kill dito si Edumax. That is the carry na nakakuha oh, ng kill. Okay. To be honest, Kilowash was a little too forward there. Yeah, he did sure. not throw the, the sickles fast enough. He did not do the job. But here comes Dian with the attempted steal using that taunt right now. Up goes May and uh, Bima with uh, that last uh, 
Shun Po. And here's Exorte get some damage there again with the full combo from a level 2 Cho. Level 3 now hitting with the flicker oh, and the only fast Exort goes down. It's a trade. Eto Max taken out by Rio. It's one for one. Pero mo ang lamang ang Eagles doon sa trade na ganun. Outplayed, outplayed SXP with May getting the catch here against the Kadita. Wala na kasing uh, rough waves si Kadita doon. So that's why SXP soon. was playing very aggressive against them. And they've gotten a very good start here for Sua Execration Punisher. At ngayon lang nakapag level 4 si Kadita. She could have survived. I'm yeah. pretty sure she could have survived if uh, she uh, popped the ult. But it's just now that she got it. And here we see uh, a team fight waiting to happen. There comes the Divine Judgment on the Bimo. Bimo able to revenge out. Oh, there the comes a falling star moon. Hand goes down. Exar gets a double kill. Lard taken out alongside Dian. And they are going to convert this 3-0 into a turtle. That is what we've been talking during the draft. The name of the game for LPE here is Get the Jump. If SXP fights, we have the Kadita to engage. Pero with the jump alone from the uh, Esmeralda, it was enough to clean the house against SXP. It was perfect. To be honest, ang ginawa ni Bimo doon, nakita mo yung bouncing ball. Yeah. To keep them exactly there, sabay pasok ni Rio. Okay, that's a what? A 4 or 5? Oh, Star Moon, there's another one. Catches Etomax using the sprint, oh, I believe. No, here comes the Numinum Blast. Missing it, and here comes Avatar of Guardian Rio getting full damage. But then again, Esmeralda Puyan, medyo maunat yan. Order of, uh, sorry, order of blunts right there. Uh, and uh, Hates is gonna rotate because he's gonna be able Yeah, lastly, looking really low. Yep. There's the taunt onto Bimo, and uh, Exhort just going back and forth. Bimo got a bouncing ball out. Yeah, with a jump from Gatot Kacha, it resets the team point the man for SXP. Ooh. Divine Judgment used by Lord to catch the Kufra. You see how this draft is uh, very intense, mga kaibigan. Back to one sila ng spells. Countered, countered, countered. Back and forth, back and forth. And I kind of like that uh, the hard catches are coming in only during the big team fights. Yeah. Hindi siya parang yung Hellcurt na every time itatry mo suntukin, titigil ka. Oo. So this is very good momentum-based action. Sagutan na to. Oo. Yung kapag may Hellcurt kasi titirik eh. Et, parang ano yun, nat natakot yung kalaban eh. Dito, balagtasan to eh. Yep. Parang ano, bagsakan. Oo. Oh. Para kay nagrap battle Rion na top lane bingo ng Hyper Dalunox and ang ganda na pagka-control with the Wave the Dragon and the Chaos Darkening from Dalunox able to secure the kill here on the Esmeralda but in the bottom lane is the Rock Wave coming out from the Kadita it's able to take down the Gatot Kacha not even able to jump with the Guardian he's gonna go down there underneath his own turret but here comes Bimo with the Tyrant's Revenge and he is just going to stop people long enough for last the Enixor to come in pero makamaka Kuha naman ng Tore up top dito ang Punishers. That's, uh, I believe, the uh, first one for them. Yeah, fair trade for both teams here. LPE is looking to set up another fight here in the middle lane. May Rock Waves Exhort. They, they exhort. They really want to engage against a target here on the side of SXP. Remember, they have two jumps. Pero mukhang mauna sila dito na May. Pero the damage, is it really enough? Force to play out is May. Pero ahabuling siya ni Lastic. Pinokpok mga kaibigan, pero wala pa namang damage output. Hinihintay talaga ni Exhort. Magpakita yung gatot kacha. Oh, I like the timing uh, that uh, the Eagles used here. They perfectly Request waited for the backup. disengage, the false skirmish, para lang makakuha pa sila ng turtle. Oh, Lord? Oh, the rage from Bimo is it enough? Take him down. Yes, it is. No, 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 I really like that. Did you see that? The flicker in with the Tyrant's Rage? Yep. Perfect execution by Bimo. Looks like Dian here is going to take some damage from Exhort. May with the Way of the Dragon. It is going to be enough to take out Exhort. Not just yet, but Bumalik oh takes Exhort. Forcing it. He's not going to be able to heal up enough. And down he goes with the only fast healing. Some damage. I believe that's also the work of the High and Dry. Yeah. Na ilang siya gamitin yung Rough Whips. Kasi alam niya, Sasayangan niya yung ultimate na yun. Pero at that moment, wala na siya magawa. It yep. was locked in yep. by the Cho and the Gatot Kasha. Yeah, you, you take what you can. Yeah. You take what you can. Almost like took down the Cho with him though. Almost. Almost. And here we see Endless Battle being picked up by Eto Max. Lightning Truncheon naman yeah. para kay Exhort. Sasakit at sasakit na yan. And, pero grabe pa napakita ni Eno dito, ni Mea. Always catching out the proper heroes. Again, oh! kakasabi ko lang. Catching out the heroes dito on the side of LPE. Pero that's the time. Medyo sustainable yan. Pero walang makunat sa tatlo. Mga kaibigan, Bimo with the jump pin. Tatamaan niya rito si Dian. Pero that's a very tanky. Gatot Kacha with the cursed helmet. Abinili niya rito. Medyo tataas pa yung damage output ng SXP. Yeah, Bimo with the bouncing ball. Would have been nice to keep them in. Kung may susunod eh. Kung may damage lang. But that's the kind of lineup that they have. Yeah. Their only real sources of damage would be... Uh, Exhort and Rio. Yeah, there you go. Lard has already purchased 
the necklace of Durant. Yung mga hero sa side ng LTE, yes, makukulit kayo. You have a very sustainable uh, team fight here. Mababawasan na yan. Maglalambot na kayo sa harap ng SXP. Oh, May picked up the Blade of Despair there. Sad sword. Mas lalo na siyang makarack up ng kills. Yep. And those Way of the Dragons that he's been getting since the early game is gonna count soon. for Ooh. more. Forced to use the rough waves here for Exhort. This is the proper time for SXP to look for objectives. But I don't know where to find it. Where, where will they find it? Hindi pa yata ready si Eto Max may paglaban. Hindi yata na-realize na pwede lang gamitin yung timing yan. Pero they're already headed towards the third Remember, walang rock waves si uh, Exhort dito. And they're gonna be able to get that for free. Asan yung Falling Starman from Esmeralda? And asan din si Gatot Katya. Naghihintay na sila dito. Ginamit na nga yung Falling Starman dito ni Esmeralda. And it is May. It is May. Nagkusun lang patayin dito. It's not show. Pero wala. Hindi nila maabot. Very mobile indeed. Pero the catch is still gonna come on our LPS. They see the uh, Numenon last will be casted here by the Lolita. As well as the Titan's Revenge, ginamit lahat. Pero on the bottom lane is a counter objective by the Lunok and Kasha trying to take down the turret. Pero LPE, hindi sila na nagpapapagyan dito. Gusto lang nila kunin yung gusto nilang kunin. Okay, Golden Staff here onto Eto Max. I think this is a better trade on the side of the Eagles. Mid turret, tier 2 for a bottom and of course, a buff. Yeah. Panalo ang Eagles dito and they didn't lose much on the side of Kilowash because yeah. Kilowash did die. But well, uh -huh. here comes the jump onto our Kaja. Lard barely gonna get away. Flicker out the safety. There goes Bimo once more. Immortality still up. May with the way of the dragon. Order Brilliance out right here by Hate. And he is going to lay down the Chaos Assault. Ooh, and lastly missing. The Numenum Blast hitting nothing but air. Down he goes. But then again, Dian is going to go first. And lastly survives with Rio? the help of the Guardian Barrier. Oh, oh my god. god. Borwark, I'm sorry, Rio go gets gets gets, gets the kill. And lastly still alive is Tama Pashadito. Bimo with a sliver of health. Kilo has taman the thing lang. Perfect timing. And here comes the counter inferno. Underneath the third, it's gonna be enough, but Double not kill. enough to take him. There's a delayed damage with the sickles, and it's a four for two trade. The jump from Dian. It missed the entire team fight. Nasa kanan yung laban sa kaliwa siya tumalon and hindi niya inabot nga yung Esmeralda na nasa harapan that took down Etomax almost taking the Esmeralda down pero the sustainability is there hindi kumapit yung Ring of Order on the Esmeralda that's why ang daming heals that came out from uh, from Rio there and this is what's hard about a lineup that is the sustained lineup yeah. kailangan mong targetin yung mayroong necklace di ba yeah. kailangan mong targetin si Lard pero isipin mo si Lard lang yan that's their support exactly and si Lard dito ang laki ng trabaho kailangan yung ring of order niya tumama kay Thumbs as well as the Esperada problem was magkahiwala yung dalawa and again, here comes Bimo oh my with the God. catch. Two people getting caught out by the Rage and the Revenge. Avatar of Guardian gonna come in, but instead, it's countered by the Falling Star Moon. Numenon oh. Blast from behind the turret, and it is going to be a two for none trade. Nice take there. Free Lord incoming for the Eagle. It would have been good for Sua Execration Punishers if si not si Dian mismo yung natalo na ni Bimo. Na Tyrant's Rage doon. He tried to go for the Avatar of Guardian, pero wala na. Patay na siya at that moment. Ang ganda nung uh, catch talaga ng yeah. uh, isang Kufra. Able to stop you with the bouncing Grabe. ball. Yaman. Also with the push. And again, look at the... Oh, Oh, May, grabe naman yung consistency. What consistency niya dito. Trabaho lang ng trabaho. I think walang catch yung LPE dito. Not and with these two. Out. Oh, Polly Sarmon. Missing an Astrid. It hits May. It and mukhang patay na si Cho dito. LPE will get the kill here Shut on down. the Cho. And they will translate this into objective as the Lord is responding. Picture perfect uh, falling star moon there by Rio. Nahuli niya si uh, May just with the edge of the circle. Yeah. Just with the, the, the perfect line. Pero you see the mindset of LPE, ah. every single time na tatalan sila, kapag wala yung, uh, kapag wala yung Gatot Kasha, they always go for the Lunok or the Kaja. Kapag nandito naman yung Gatot Kasha, lagi nilang inahanap si Dian. Mm -hmm. And again, perfect yung ginawa kanina ni Rio. Habang nag-charge yung guard, uh, Star Guardian, Okay, Falling Star Moon Knight has stopped yeah. right there. And it the comes Lord. out much faster. Lastly with the Guardian's Barrier, uh, the Guardian's Bulwark here. Oh my god, the damage output is high enough for LPE to take a turret down. SXP, what can you do against the push of the Eagles? Arrival on this turret, para lang madali yung push dito. Pero Bimo going in with a jump, with the Falling Star Moon. Get a catch up, tumalas yung kaliwa. Pero wala dyan yung laban! It's on the right side. The heroes down already on the side of SXP. Make that four as uh, Hate is airborne right now. Hinahamos yung Esmeralda. The Kufra has been slain by the Ketot Kacha. Pero it's just... The, the uh, Gatot Kaja against three heroes of LPE. This is over, ladies and gentlemen, as Dian will fall inside his own base. Makakapag-BGM pa siya, pero bukas na bukas na yung bahay nila. All that LPE needs to do is clear the minion waves, get them into the core, and force 
the issue. Rio. Get the win. There's not much the end can do here. We're two seconds away. One second now for May. Here he comes. Wala sir, Mo ang maapag defend pa to. Yeah, May and Lord is alive right now for SXP. Madedeline nga nila yung push Shut ng LPE dito. Mapapatin lili yung dalawa. Maakali si Lasty though. Pero again, bukas yung base ng uh, SXP. Mahirapan na huminga dito ang Punishers. Uh, I believe the next step for uh, the uh, Eagles is to choke them out of resources even yeah. further. Holy Crystal up for hate, so tumata at stand down to output the Luna of Tito, pero it's still negligible at this point. It's just a concentrated energy in a Holy Crystal in front of, of a very tanky lineup ng uh, LPE. Yes, may necklace of Durant's ka, pero again, the question, the condition is you need to hit both heroes here on the side of LPE, the Esmeralda and the Sam. And again, what makes it so hard is for the whole game, it seems like hate was neutralized. Oh, oh Bimo? Bimo hit with the Wave of the Dragon and a Divine Judgment. Pop it oh, this is big. Down he goes. It's a pick off onto our Kufra. And I think a lot of the team fights that LPS won was off the back of Bimo. So this yeah. is a big loss for them. That team fight on the top lane, nung na take down LPE yung final turret ng SXP, it started with a very beautiful jump from Bimo. Ngayon, 20 seconds without the Kufra for LPE, they can make something out of this one. Pero Kilowash already setting up the pressure on the top lane para hindi makagawa ng movement ng SXP. Uh, I think Kilowash here is uh, doing the right job, just buying some time. Yeah. And I think they are gonna wait for Bimo. Hindi sila pwede gumalaw na wala si Bimo. Yeah, for sure. And SXP dito, you need to use the time that you have right now. Shadow Mask is gonna be uh, used here para makahanap sila ng pick-off. They might see the Kadita, pero the jump, the jump is really there from Lord Divine Judgment, hindi umabot! And it is gonna be short, Luminon Blast here being jumped, as well as the Falling Star Moon. This looks like a team fight for oh, the ages. Ito Mask gonna be back it off. Rio takes out Lard. Exor taken out by Hate. It's a trade for our mages. Rio still up. Dian taking a lot of damage. And here comes Bimo, oh, Bimo. once more with the Tyrant's Rage into the wall. Bimo goes down to Eto Max. Eto Max spraying so much damage. Here comes Rio. Silasi na lang ang kanyang tank na nagigira. May 1v1. 1v1 But up top, us. it's a fighter matchup. Mukhang team Masi, fight na. Pero in the 1v1 lang to. Eto Max taking out. Oh Lasty. my god, this guy. Lasty still up. Charging up the Numenon Blast. Down he goes. Hindi nilulusot. Pinaglalaruan lang siya. And Rio gets the kill with the double damage. Magic and Ooh. physical. It is Finally. going to be 4 for 3. Grabe yung batuan dito ng LPE. You saw that jump from Gatot Kacha. It deleted the backlines of LPE. It made the team fight harder para kay Esmeralda. And si Eto Max, again, kabisado kabisado yung si Kari. Mm -hmm. It's so good. Muntik niya nang mapatay pa si Rio. Yeah. But again, Rio takes shields, gives it. Woo! And again, na burst down niya ang ating Kari in Eto Max. And it looks like they're gonna go contest this Lord. Naka purify ba yung Kadita? Uh, the Divine Judgment was used no, on him. It was nothing. It didn't work. Oh my god, the Rock deals so much Lord damage. Here. Exor taking out Lard once more. Dian with the taunt push out. Charging up. Rio with the Falling Star Moon taking out Dian as well as Hate. It's a three for non trade. This Hate is it. Running for his life. Nasaan si Eto Max just clearing out waves. Just wait for Lasty. Feeling ko ay lang yung si Lasty. It's just a show and a carry. LPE right now. You can finish this game. Pero you need to wait for the minion wave. Relax. Nakupo na si Papa ni May. Si Kilawas dito. Remember, medyo masakit yung damage si Kari. Pero Rio with the jump from the backlands. Mamamatay si Kari dito. Moment of last. Will hit the Joe as well. And this is it. LPE has done it. Game 3. Sa kanila, the curse is real. It is not a curse at this point. It's a blessing. Oh they my win God! Game. There's the recall party. This is it. 15 minutes in, the Eagles are going to fly, ladies and gentlemen. 2-1 in favor of the Eagles. LPE gets the win. Still undefeated. Inyo na ang game one. Samen ang series win. LPE with a